up YouTube it's the one and only Lily Lisa and I'm back with another video and today's video we are going to be doing a Shein try in ugh, a Shein try on haul I cannot say that for some reason <laughs> but um so you know I was gonna throw some lashes on for y'all or whatever but I decided not to because you know I'm gonna be trying things on and I don't want to like mess them up where they come off and then it's like this whole stupid thing or whatever so anyway i just got a couple of pieces i would say i have like maybe 10 to maybe 15 different things i can't remember exactly how many things i ordered but it's like different little pieces that i'm gonna show you guys i'm so excited it's my first time ordering something from shein um of course this is not sponsored but um yeah i just wanted to share this with you guys so let's go ahead and get into the video so this outfit that I have on right now is some champion joggers and just like a regular little t-shirt from Walmart and you guys get into the green hair. You know, for St. Patrick's Day or whatever. So yeah, I made sure the baby hairs was laid. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into piece or outfit number one. I'ma just go ahead and open it. I'm so excited. This is my first time. I just wanted to open this on camera just to show y'all. Like, I haven't looked at the pieces since I got them, since I ordered them. So, I just want to see how the packaging is. So, as you can see, I have quite a few pieces. One of the things in here I do have is like a bonnet. So, um, I think I got like a bonnet and a scarf. I'll just show you what I have as I got. Okay, so this is outfit number one. Um, I'll actually put the link below or like screenshot exactly what it was on the order, but this is outfit number one. This is actually a romper, one piece. Um, I believe it was. It's the size two X, and I would like to say it fits me pretty good. I probably wouldn't wear these underwear, or I might even. I mean, it really doesn't look that bad, but I mean, I like it. It's given with the hair, you know what I'm saying. So this is outfit number one. And then, you know, like, you can even pair it with a bag. Like, I have this Puma bag here, this Army Fatigue Puma bag. And it has just, like, different colors of green. So, I just feel like, you know, with some black tennis shoes. That would be cute. Like, for the summer, you know what I'm saying? It's giving, it's giving sexy mama, you know? So yeah, this is outfit number one. So next will be outfit number two. I feel kind of like a baby. Like a baby with a sleep around. Okay, y'all, now, I was real bold with this one, so don't laugh at me when you see it, okay? 
Just comment below what y'all think about this one, all right? Be honest, too. All right, here we go. Okay. So, you gotta be real confident wearing this one because I don't know. I'm giving mommy stretch marks, which I definitely am a mom of three girls. I have three girls, no boys. But, um, I mean, I can kind of get into it. I can kind of get into it a little bit. I think Bay would like me. I don't know if he'd like me showing y'all this though, but yeah. That's what it's giving. Like it, you see, it's the it says Paris on it. Let me try to get the angle. There we go. I mean, I like it for the most part. Bay cleaning the fish tank. I should go interrupt him. Let's see. Bay, you busy? Oh, I know you busy. Oh, never mind. What do you think about this? It's a two piece. It looks good. I like it. You like it? Oh, yeah. Boy! Hell yeah. Shit. I like that. I don't know where I'm going to wear it to, but. <laughs> so, I mean, Bay approved, so. All that matters to me. Kind of nervous though a little bit. Can we just give y'all some somewhat full body? Try to give you as much full body as I can. But this is also a 2X. So and this is the whole set. I saw some had just the shirt or just the skirt, but I wanted the matching set. So this is how it looks. Try to get a little bit more snatched you know definitely wouldn't wear this bra or underwear like i said like you have to pick your underwear with your outfit you know what i'm saying like you can't just wear any kind of underwear any kind of color with any kind of outfit period so yeah so with that outfit that i just had on um i would probably pair that with maybe like this kind of purse I never wore it yet. It looks like it got like a couple indents on it, but yeah, I would probably wear it. My mom gave me these pants. She had just bought them. She can't fit them. She lost like a whole bunch of weight, so you know she tried to give them to me. But I was looking at these pants like that actually might look cute with that crop top, and then with that back. You feel know I me? Mean? Like that would probably be cute as an outfit. So um, as far as in shoes, I would say like. Maybe some square white low, you know, what do they call them? Like slide sandals, like some white sandals, I think would be cute. Like white or beige, maybe like that color beige sandal. Or even like that color orange, burnt orange sandal. Or even like a white sandal. Even a black sandal. Like there's different shoes that you could put, but I would definitely recommend like a sandal to go with that. It's like summertime. But she'll probably be hot in the summer with these on, huh? <laughs> okay. So, this is piece number three. The top, actually. Um, also a 2X. Everything that I ordered clothing-wise was a 2X. So, this is like a crop top. It's like a cow print. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's like the cow print, as you can see, it's like fluffy sleeves, but for some reason, this one is like scrunched, and this one is like not so scrunched. So I don't know what that's about, but I mean, it's cute. I mean, it fits, it's comfortable. I like it. Yeah. 
yeah so this is piece number three um i don't have anything else that's cow print besides like my phone case <laughs> if you can see that um so i don't know what like bag i would put this with or anything but Yeah, man, sexy mama. <clears throat> it's giving concert, it's giving out of town, it's giving the beach. Like with some shorts, this be cute. Okay, so this is piece number three. Also to this, and so like I really like the detail, and I just like moved my bra over, so you're not able to see it, but it makes me look like real snatch, like girl, what ways to get? <laughs> but yeah, I really like this. Um, these are just some pants, like I. I may or may not wear something like this with the pants together, but I mean, the top is really cute, without a doubt. I don't know what kind of, you know, like I said, pants or so. Like, I would probably wear like a skirt with this. I would probably try to find like a really cute skirt with that. But yeah, I really like that. Okay, y'all, this is the last um, clothing piece that I have. And it's like really risky. Um, I'm not really sure about this one, but I went ahead and tried it on anyway for you guys. So please do not, please do not be mean. Um, I really don't like it. Just me personally, the color is cute, but you know, I'm gonna just show y'all. So I went ahead and put my hair in a ponytail just so I can show y'all the details in the back. So, I mean, I do kind of like it for like a party type scene or some shit, but like, I don't even party, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even go nowhere for this. What was I thinking? Like, this is very like go-go girlish, but it's giving like sporty at the same time. It's giving sporty at the same time. I don't know. I mean, it's very like spandexy, you know. So I already know how to feel about this one, but this is it. Like I said, it's also a two X. So I I don't know. Leave a comment below on what y'all think about this because <laughs> just don't be mean about it, but. I mean, the color is cute. The material is okay, but I mean, you would probably sweat a lot. That's why I said it's giving sporty, you know, like Olympics. <laughs> it's giving Simone Biles. Whew. 
had to start to work up a sweat, y'all. That was that was that was a lot, y'all. So I don't put me some shorts on now because like, yes, it's it's literally that hot, and I don't want to turn the fan on and then the sound be all wonky. You know what I'm so um, move y'all right here. So, I just got a couple more pieces, and then I'm going to let y'all go. So, I wanted to show y'all. I'm super excited about this piece particularly because I've been eating a wallet for a while. Um, I didn't got this obsession with, like, cheetah print stuff. I got, like, so much cheetah leopard print stuff. It don't make no sense. So, I went ahead and got this wallet. And I'm going to show you why I got this wallet in just a second. I want to open it. Oh my goodness, it's so adorable. Look at the inside. Okay, so usually they have like a special pocket for the ID. I don't see that. But otherwise than that, look at it. It is so soft. I love stuff like this, so. Love it. They got like a little wrist wrist strap. I got this because it's very similar to this. Now this is very like different of me. This is a bucket hat. So I'm gonna put this down. But as you can see, it's like a resemblance to the patterns and stuff. So We're gonna see if these can even fit my big ass here. Okay, it look kind of deep. But I do got these braids in. Let's see. Let's put it half and half, lay it super flat. Let's see how good it'll go on. It actually fit. It actually, it actually fit. It's on my head, y'all. Oh my God. I have never owned a bucket hat. It's cute. I like it. And then with the wallet, we style that profile. I don't know i'm weird and quirky i like this kind of stuff so it's cute to me let's try the next one that'll be cute like with some you know straight to the back braids or with like if you got a wrap or something like a low ponytail that'd be super cute with that but i got a couple more bucket hats actually So this one is like a colorful camouflage one. Feels like a little bigger actually. Okay. This is cute. I can see this with like the one piece. I can see that. I can see that. That would be cute. It's giving. It's giving style. It's giving unique. It's giving personality. It's giving sexy tomboy. I got one more, y'all. I I know. I know. I kind of went a little crazy with these, but trust the process. Cause I've been getting more into fashion lately. Like I never was able to get into fashion because. It didn't used to be like so many options for like plus size women. So now that I'm seeing people, you know, I'm trying to support the companies that do have those choices for us that, you know, give us versatility. It gives us like style. We can 
you know, dress stuff up, mix and match. Like, you don't have to get everything from one place, of course, but you can, like, cross style, you know what I'm saying? Let's try this one on. Oh, yes. Now, this one, this one is probably gonna be my favorite watch. Y'all probably gonna get tired of me taking pictures with this one because this, let me get this other angle. Look at that. You can't tell me that ain't cute. You cannot tell me that's not cute. Baby. So, um, one of the last pieces that I do have is a bonnet. I really like this color. It's so cute. And it's like silky on the inside. I love a good bonnet, period. You know, baby got to take care of them hairs, baby hairs, and all that hair. You know? Anyway, um, so yeah. I'm going to stuff these braids into a bun just wrapped it around real quick and i was just gonna see because this is like really big like look how big that stretches like that's huge <laughs> so and then you have this little thingy right here and then you could tighten it up so, yeah. just throw it on real quick and baby if it if it, my gremlin calling me. Hold on, y'all. It fit, y'all. Oh my gosh. It actually fit. And it's pretty. It's cute. Oh my god, what does she want? So, yeah, that's one of my little scarves. And then I have this one. Hold on. Okay. Now, I really, 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 really like this. This is so pretty. Like, I don't even want to wear it on my head. It's so beautiful. So, like, how I usually wear these kind of scarves, I would... Fold it like this. So anyway, y'all, I ain't gonna keep y'all too much longer. This is one of the last things um, that I got from Shein, and it's just a scarf, like a silk satin scarf. I would usually just, you know, wrap it around like so. You feel me? You know, I got the bonnet on under there, but this is how I usually wrap my scarf. This is how I usually wrap my hair at night, even with my braids, because it protects the top of the braids, you know, and keep it from looking so rough so early on. You know, having this style, protective style, or even just your natural regular hair, you always keep something on your hair i usually do even when my hair is not done i keep something on my hair i keep my hair in like a moisturized low bun something anything y'all just see me say that in the last video so if you go watch and pay attention you'll see okay y'all so this is actually the last thing that i have that i bought and then i'm gonna let y'all go I just thought this was super cute. I told y'all I have this obsession with like cheetah print or leopard print and that's all this is. It's like a puff. And I already have this on my keys. So, I mean, I just think it'd be really cute if I just snap that on here. You feel me? It's the cuteness for me, the girly girlness. So yeah, and then 
I just have this on my keys too because I don't know, I'm a creepy little weirdo and shit. So I just like this kind of stuff. What is that? Like the nightmare before Christmas? Or comment down below if you know exactly the name of the movie that this came from because I can't think of it right now. But y'all know what I'm talking about. I really like it. 90s baby. Kurt. Yeah, I think that is it, you guys, for this video. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and sit down. All right, you guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Um, I hope y'all like it. I hope y'all stay to the end because I really appreciate the support um really trying to grow my channel even if i can get to a thousand subscribers within this year if i can get a thousand subscribers by the end of the year i would be so grateful um i definitely enjoy posting content for the people who do watch for the people who are subscribed and do continue to subscribe thank you so much and i hope you guys enjoyed this video I usually don't show myself like that, especially not my stomach. I'm very self-conscious about that. So for me to even film this video and show with y'all, you better like, comment, and subscribe. I'm not even playing like, listen, I'm breaking out of my shell. I'm really an introvert. You know, I don't really have too many friends, so. People that come and they subscribe and they like my videos, they watch my videos. Y'all the lovely fam, period. That's the game. So without further ado, don't forget to be kind. Don't forget to be genuine. Help someone, you know, inspire somebody. Try to be kind, please. Um, reach out to your people um, that you don't hear from because those are the ones trying to be strong and they don't want to burden anybody but you know even just a phone call to check up on somebody always remember to be conscious of others and that's the whole point of me making this video is for other women to be confident in their bodies the plus size women you know women in general just be confident in who you are and embrace that because we only live once so I love you guys, lovely fam. I don't want to get all emotional. I'm about to get up out of here. Love y'all. The next one. Peace. I'm out. And that's a wrap. And that's a wrap. And that's a wrap. And that's a wrap. <laughs> Peace, y'all. Oh, yeah, one more thing. She and I loved the items. It's only one that I was disappointed with, which was the purple shirt. But it, even still, it's still a vibe. You know, it all depends on what you want to do with it or what you're trying to do. But I'm very impressed um, with their items, the material, the comfort, the look, the fit. She in. You doing something. You wanted something. Like I said, everything I ordered was 2X. Two, two it was true to size. Um... And yeah, I definitely will order more items from them. Very affordable. Um, I don't even think it was one item I had besides the two piece that was over like ten, eleven, twelve dollars. So this whole order only came up to seventy dollars. And I'll probably input the order info from my cart or however. But yeah, stay on the lookout. Might be another haul. Who knows?